Today in our video series, we'll be discussing the 1970 Ferrari 365 GTB Ford Daytona. When it came time to replace the 275 GTB4, Enzo Ferrari chose to retain the traditional front-mounted Colombo V12 and rear-drive layout, though opted for a sleek, ultra-modern steel and aluminum body design by Leonardo Fioravante at Pininfarina. Informally dubbed Daytona following Ferrari's sweep at the Daytona 24-hour the prior year, it was the most expensive and fastest road car in Ferrari's then 21-year history, sporting equipment including a tube steel frame, all independent wishbone and coil spring suspension, along with four-wheel power-assisted disc brakes. It gained international attention when one was put in the hands of Dan Gurney and Brock Yates for the inaugural Cannonball Run. This Daytona carries a front-mounted all-alloy, 4-cam, 4.5-liter V12 with dry sump lubrication. It's mated to a 5-speed transaxle with limited slip differential, delivering a near 50-50 weight distribution. It received a complete mechanical refurbishment between 2013 and 2014. The cabin is trimmed with beige Connolly leather seats with black accents. A wood steering wheel frames Velia Borletti instrumentation with 8,000 RPM tachometer. Additional features include black mouse hair dash trim, a gated shifter, and air conditioning. Daytona features styling penned by Pininfarina's Leonardo Fioravante. This Italian delivered example is one of approximately 410 built with fixed position headlights behind a plexiglass nose. Other features include Euro specification lighting, including clear and amber front turn signals with prancing horse accents and staggered Barani knockoff wheels. It's finished in Rosso Robino. The Ferrari 365 GTB for Daytona became an instant classic when it married modern to tradition, offering enthusiasts the best of both worlds. A Daytona in its purest form. This one's not to be missed.